Kevin, would you rather? What is your... Oh, well, yeah, we'll, we'll dive into the would you rather now. Uh, there is no... There is no good transition because this is just completely off. Of what we were, so it's was it your last topic that was the accordion for legs, or did we have one more after that? I, can't nah, I think there was another one, one. Okay. in between there somewhere. That was gold. That was a phenomenal topic. So there's, there's that one, but now there's this. <laughs> Would you rather relive the same day for 365 days? Grandma does. Yep. Or just straight up lose a year of your life? Fuck me. I like this one a lot because I like one who I like to think about past, present, and future and memories. This encompasses all of it. Question before we start: Has anyone seen Groundhog Day? Here? Yes, phenomenal movie. Yes, I saw it 15 years ago. I say it's good, but I really can't justify that answer. It's a good movie. So okay. why? Are you, so what was the point of? Because that? that's immediately <laughs> what I thought of. <laughs> so I had to now. I had to I, establish. If you that. weren't going to elaborate, what was the point? We don't need to. I. Me and you are similar again, and this, I hate to say this, these words. What, what, we sit across the table, and now we're fucking me, similar out the ass? What the me, fuck me, is going no, on? In this fuck aspect, this show. We're similar in this aspect. We both love efficiency. Oh, yeah. We hate wasting time, right? Yeah. So, part of my answer immediately is like, let me just skip this year of going through the same day of nonsense, get to the end. But then I'm like, but this opens up a sandbox, if I can just relive the same day i can do whatever i want that day and there's gonna be no consequence in, in theory i'm assuming right end of the day correct. whatever happens i wake up in bed that i would have woken up correct the next morning it's so like it's, literally a, ground it's like an yeah that and you know the last tomorrow. day is we're cruising over to the next exactly so if i master everything that's gonna happen in that day like from everything that i could master first of all i spent at least a month emptying my bank account doing something crazy you know, like day one, go skydiving. How far could you get with two hundred dollars? That was low hanging fruit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but either way, <laughs> empty my empty account. my bank account, go bonkers, like a month at least, and just do crazy stuff like travel for a day. You know, I could literally go to Italy. I mean, at least half the day, go to Italy, stay up all night, pass out, and I'm back home. You know, do that again with the next country. You know, keep doing. I'm letting you go, and then I'm gonna talk. Yeah, <laughs> I would do that at least for a month. Then I would just start to look at stock trends or something like that for just just for a month. You're so annoyed. Just see where all the big stocks it's go. It's not a month. It's a day. I know, but You're I'm saying a month of those much. days. It doesn't matter. You don't know what's maybe, happening in the next. Maybe there's a penny stock that goes freaking nuts that day. Okay, keep going. Cause I'll, you know, I'll why, not, why not pay attention to that? One day of just looking at the trends. At the end of the day, I just sum everything up, see what grew the most. You know, why not? Lottery numbers, see what the lottery numbers at the end of the day. Like even that, like, well, hopefully there's a drawing on that day that you're infinitely reliving or 365 days reliving. I like to think that everything on that day in this world is the same other than things that you actually interfere with. Well, yeah. that's what, So what, then you, you actually, I guess, never know what you're changing. Yeah, because I wouldn't be, Yeah. especially with something like the lottery. I wouldn't be interfering with anything that would change the lottery number. True. Generally yeah, speaking, well, unless there's well, a butterfly effect, of course. What? Well, yeah, you're stuck with that day. Yeah. But that day's outcome is already predetermined, essentially. Exactly. I mean... I, what you do in it, but it's... The, the universe doesn't picture, revolve around you, yeah, so it doesn't... The big picture things are already in motion, exactly. Can I Only, speak now? Yes, of course. You can do whatever you want. Now, you're fucked because... <laughs> this is the thing. I was so on board. You started talking and you're like, oh man, I love Kevin's topic. I'm going to suck his dick. You're like, I'm going <laughs> to exactly go do all these saying. things, right? Go bonkers. Yeah, like, I'm going to go bonkers. I'm going to see here. I'm going to see there. I feel like in the grand scheme of things, you're going to ruin all those things for you. You're going to, because this is the thing. In those 365 days, which is a long fucking time, a year. Yeah. you're going to hit everything. It's great. You're, what about your partner? What about your friends? I know. I would You're going to have experienced everything already. You will never experience a new thing at that point. Because basically, you can get nearly every anywhere in the world in that day, right? More you might less, only... Yeah. Australia, we're going to get an hour and a yeah, half yeah, there yeah. or so. But you can go there. Yeah. You're going to ruin everything. Because by default, you will have to go basically everywhere yeah. in that 365 days. That's what I'm saying. Do you lose it? And there, but there's also the aspect where 
you're experiencing these things and you're re- you're remembering whatever you're doing. Exactly. Yeah. And the people that you're with They're aren't not necessarily. Right. Yeah. No. So you're gonna wake up you're like li- the next day. You're gonna be like, holy shit, Fiji was fucking awesome. <laughs> and your girlfriend's gonna be like, what are you talking about? What you kind fucking of dream? Like the Fiji? What kind of dream did you just have? No, she's gonna think you fucking. I had a crazy dream. No. <laughs> she's not going to think I <laughs> she's not gonna went to Fiji. Yeah. You're living a lie at that point. That's what I'm saying. I was so on board where I was like, fuck, I'm going to get everywhere. Short term, that's fucking dope. Selfishly, that's fucking dope. But again, it's, all, it's selfish. Absolutely. It's selfish. Long term, you, you, you've basically ruined almost anything to be special. It doesn't have to in not terms be of sightseeing. If that's what you want to be, though, like I'm a yeah. traveler, yeah. right? So I want to see the world. I would rather. No, no, I can't say I'd rather because the thing is, that whole free year you have to do all those things, you might not be able to do all those things in your lifetime. Because exactly. it's not just a matter of having the money; it's also a matter of having the time. If you know you have an infinitely repeatable day, you can not infinitely, but you know you have a repeatable day. You can do all these things with z- literally zero temporal consequence. Oh, yeah. And that's what's that's honestly probably the big unless you're stupid rich to where you don't have to work and there's no more time anymore. Then you can do all those things anyway. But if you do have to work, which I'm you know, most people are going to have to work most of their lives. You don't have that time to visit every country I, you know, for me. Every I'm, experience. I'm just more a long term thinker and satisfier. So I'm thinking short term happiness. I'm fucking yeah. coasting. But long term, I mean, I'm losing that extra. I'm losing the experience. Of going to all these places, like even now with my girlfriend Nicole, where I've her number one, one of her number one spots is England, right? Yeah. And I went there in 2007 when I was yeah, in seventh yeah. grade, and I say all the time, the first place we have no money that we're going is fucking not England because <laughs> I've been there. Yeah. And now, and in she this wants world to go where I pick yeah. 365 days. I've basically been. Because I'm not going to waste those 365 days unless I want to try and be smart about it yeah. by going to the nonsense places, right? Like the yeah. outskirts of the world. I'm going to go to all the spots I want to hit. Yeah. Oh, there's plenty of time to hit. Yeah, I'm going to take those 365 days yeah, but- no matter what. Whether or not I travel everywhere, I'm taking those 365 days because you can even one day being practical, doing something that can set you up. And the thing that this is going to do is you're going to be the only one that's going to remember this shit. So you're... You're gonna learn to cherish. I don't know all of those moments because you know, like, no one else is gonna remember any of that. I really didn't think I'd pick this answer, but I think I'm I'm picking. So you're gonna, it. So you're gonna cherish it. any little moment that happens because you're gonna be like, all right, well, I'm gonna be the only one that's gonna remember any I, of this shit. I, I so. think uh, it's gonna control too much of my life going forward. Where, and I'm not a. I, like I like you said, I'm a man of efficiency and not yeah. wasting time. So wasting a year of my life is fucking huge. So you're just gonna take you're just gonna take a year and just crumple it up and toss it aside. How about this? You're gonna jump right to twenty five. How about this? Thanks. Yeah, fuck twenty four. Right. I mean, twenty five. I rent a car. Who said you have to go do all these crazy things? Why not spend a year playing Call of Duty eight eight hours a day and become a god? <laughs> and three hundred sixty five d- days because later, you start Phase Clan too. It's just why not do something like that? It's, but ima- no, could you imagine this? Would though? you want that? Ready? No, you grind all day. You get like fifty. You get like blue tiger on the M16. Oh, yeah, you you wake up the next day and it's yeah. gone. That's exactly. <laughs> but all your, shit. Do I have that? Do I still have that skill that I gained from playing that eight hours? Well, yeah. Well, yeah you remember every day. Yeah. Heard. So even if it's just for that, even if it's just for grinding out a skill, pick up a guitar for a year. You would Who just. Cares? Play guitar every day. Buy look, guitar at Grand, every day. look at the movie Grand Ugly, right? Yeah. Eventually, it got ruined for him. Where well, it was eventually, the same monotonous stuff over and over again. You would get to that point no matter what. But here's the problem: he didn't know when it was going to end, and two, he kept trying to find a way out. There's a huge difference between where eventually that character's going. Eventually, you will find try to find a way out. There is three hundred. Where were you last year? Totally different Nick than we were last Absolutely year. Absolutely totally different Nick. But here's here's a point you miss. I know where you're going when you pause for someone. Just I love singing. I love being I love not home. going out. I love, I love not going home. outside. You don't think I could put hours and hours and hours into grinding 
I literally have said on multiple occasions. Okay, but is that worth your long term happiness? That's what I'm saying. Yeah, why you're not? gonna burn that. I'm burning anything. Not that. Like, what if it's a day? Like, you wake up. You wake up. Your dad comes walking in. Sup, Nick? <laughs> your mom comes in. Hi, honey. Next thing you know, some toast burns in the oven. <laughs> And you're going through all these things. You're going to get reach the point where you're going to be like, you're just going to be mastering every little nuance of the day. Yeah, exactly. Started. It will be ground until day. you reach a point where, yeah, until you reach a point where you no, but fly off to I Antigua would, or whatever I would still, you do. <laughs> I would still take that opportunity. If nothing else, I would take that opportunity 365 days to learn a skill. I can do, I can play eight hours of guitar a day and it's completely on. To me, I'm living a lie because it's an unfair advantage. It, no, you're still putting the time in. I mean, yeah, it's free but no time. one else got your. Yeah, but here's the deal: you could still, you could either skip the year, you know, you have the choice to skip the year, or you could go travel the whole year, and you're not putting that time into a skill. You but know, I'm what's still living see, the lie that no, no you... one else had that opportunity? That's the problem for me. If no, if but that's I the see, case that everyone's I, living a lie because everyone like, has different scaling opportunities. I don't, know, I don't know. I feel like you're. You're not going the way I thought you would. No, I didn't little... think. No, I didn't think I would go this way either. But I'm just concerned. I'm saying like the long term. I, I, I don't want to experience everything in a year. What's, I don't you don't have to. No I don't think you'd to. be able to live with just taking a year and throwing it tossing it over your shoulder. And I mean, once you make the whatever. decision, it's over. There's yeah, no going yeah. back. So that's you want to talk about a waste of time. That's yes. a I know. sincere waste of time. I know. But like I said, <laughs> why would you? Why would you just throw it away when you could literally have a free year? Because I'm gonna Even, burn. It's gonna tarnish the rest of the years. Because. Ex- Exactly what you two are talking about. I love to maximize my time. So if I had the same day through five days, you better fucking believe I'm doing everything. Everything in that year where I know I have the reset button. So I'm gonna make it's gonna be worse for me than someone who doesn't. Does that make sense to you? you I could make it now? tougher and like it like hat like you don't have the ability to to control it yourself. To go wherever it's the same fucking day. Oh, over no, easy. You're skipping your fuck that. Yeah, no, you're literally living the same day. No, I would choose not. But I'm mm-hmm. saying you get a free day. Hell yeah. Free, free day every day. For, no. Hell yeah. Absolutely. I'm picking. Absolutely. I'm skipping a year. You two are fucking. Absolutely. I'll play, I'll play mandolin for your year. I don't care. I'll do anything. Do you know what the mandolin is? Yeah, the mandarin was one of the evil enemies in Iron Man 2. Which, he the, was a joke villain. Take the 365 days and just read a book. I did just buy a book. Sidebar. Console Wars. That's the title. Cool. About, see if you actually read that. <laughs> dude. <laughs> I, like, I thought I was going to read it. I'm going to read it. I'm going to at least read yep. some of it. Yep. This book's fucking... It was way thicker than I thought. <laughs> it's about Sega and Nintendo battling back in the day because okay. no one remembers that they were fucking arch fucking enemies yeah. to the death where people like to say Xbox versus PlayStation. Or, yeah, but all those fucking companies, like they actually talk to each other. It it's not a thing. Sega and Nintendo didn't get along. Thank you guys for watching or listening. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel at youtube.com slash foreplay video. If you like what we're doing, make sure to smash that like button. Be sure to share all our videos with your friends so we can uh, continue to grow. And uh, we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.